Okay, I'm going to finish off with the most powerful demonstration of top-down processing that I've ever come across. It's in the auditory domain, and it relates to the claim that there are satanic messages embedded in rock music. This is a claim that's put about by, particularly by American Christian fundamentalists, um, and the idea is they think that even though you cannot hear the messages when you play the record forward, you can only hear them when you play the record backwards, they think that that can still have an influence, presumably, and tempt young boys and girls from the path of righteousness into sex and drugs and even more rock and roll. Um, now, there are websites you can go to, and they're really great fun. What you typically find is you'll play the backwards clip, and you can't make out what the message is. And then you read it, or someone tells you, and you play it again, and you think, yeah, I can kind of hear it now. Um, and, of course, it's top-down processing. Once you know what you're supposed to hear, then you've got that expectation. Now, there has to be a kind of top of the satanic pops, and for me, it's definitely Led Zeppelin. Um, so I'm going to play you a clip from Stairway to Heaven, First of all, I'm going to play it forwards for no other reason than I like it. That's all there is to it. I'm going to play the clip forwards, then I'm going to play the same clip backwards, and your task is to tell me what the satanic message is. And I predict that unless you've heard it before, you will get maybe one or two words, but most of it will sound like backwards gibberish. Now, there's a very good reason for that. It's because it is backwards gibberish. <laughs> But then I'm going to tell you what the message is. I'm going to play it again. And the second time, it will sound completely different. You will hear the message as clear as a bell. You will wonder how you missed it the first time. The reason you missed it the first time is it isn't there. Right. Okay, so here we go. Here's the, um, the forwards clip. Okay, now under the ethical guidelines of the British Psychological Society... If you do not want to run the risk of becoming the next recruit to Satan's army, you can leave the room now. It's too late for me. I sing the backwards version to myself all the time. So. All right, here we go. Uh, sorry, no, we don't. Here we go with the backwards version. So listen out for the satanic message. <laughs> Any offers? Satan. Right, and again, it's top-down processing. What's the word you're most likely to hear when I'm talking about satanic messages? It's Satan. But according to the websites that believe in this kind of thing, this is the full message. Here's to my sweet Satan, the one whose little path would make me sad, whose power is Satan. He'll give you 666, supposedly the devil's number. There was a little tool shed, I can explain the tool shed, <laughs> where he made us suffer, sad Satan. I'm now going to play the same clip again, I promise it's the same clip, uh, and it'll sound completely different. You'll hear the message. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.